Hello lovely people, welcome to the Geek Cupboard, I am Penge and welcome back to Unpacking. So we played the demo of this back in the summer and it was really, really good. And now we are back with the proper full version of the game and I've been looking forward to this an awful lot. I've been counting down the days, the demo was wonderful. So yes, I am very excited to jump into the full game. If you didn't see the demo, Unpacking is a game that tells the story of a person's life through their homes and their belongings. And the idea is that we catch up with this person as they've just moved home and we have to unpack their things from boxes and put these things away. And that's kind of it. It's as simple as that. We get stuff out of boxes and we put the stuff away somewhere. It's nice and calm and relaxing and very important. There is a story to be told about this person's life, which we can work out from the things we're unpacking. So there's a kind of nice narrative element to the game too, as well as the whole putting things away thing, which is good. I like that. I like stories. So that's a good thing. They've got that in there. It's out now on Steam. There is a link to the Steam store page in the video description below. And we were given a key by the publishers, which is very nice. So thank you, publishers. Now, a quick caveat before we start, the publishers have asked that to make sure that everyone can enjoy the moments of discovery and unpacking for themselves, we avoid story spoilers as much as possible, and that we avoid revealing specific details from a certain point onward which might be quite tricky. We'll see how that goes, but I shall do my very best. Right, anyway, there are boxes to be unpacked, so let's get unpacking. Oh, this is very good. I do like this. So rather than choosing a save slot to save our progress as we play, we get to choose a book. So we can have the red book, the blue book, or the green book. I mean, of course, we will choose the Geek Cover Corporate Blue Book. Obviously, we will. And then we get to write our name in it, like a children's book. So this book belongs to Penge. Of course it does. I like that. I like that idea. It's way more interesting than just picking, you know, slot one or slot two or whatever. So there we go. We've claimed our lovely Geek Cupboard Corporate Blue Book. So here we go. And as you can see, our story starts quite a few years ago. So come back in time with me, everybody. Wibbly wobbly time travel effects have happened. And we find ourselves in the year 1997, which is where the story of our character here begins. Now, of course, if you have seen the video that we did of the demo of this game, this is going to be relatively familiar because I don't think they've changed too much with the early levels. But we're going to go through them anyway, because we need to do these levels to uncover a bit about the person who lives here. You know, going to figure out what they're like and what they're doing and how old they are maybe and all that kind of stuff. So here we go. This is what we've got. So our character, our person, the person whose life we're following in 1997 lives in this room here. And it's a lovely room. I like this room. It's got a bed that you have to get access to via climbing a ladder, which is all very exciting and a little bit kind of piratey. So there we go. So they've got a high up bed. They've got some shelves over here. There's a kind of desk here. You can't really see, but there is a chair just there. There is a chair next to the desk. There's a kind of cupboardy thing here. There's some curtains and a window. And then we have these boxes here. So what we need to do is we need to click on the boxes and then just unpack the items that are contained therein. So let's start with this one here, shall we? So there we go. And we have a rummage around. And the first thing we find is a book. So a book with a bear on it. Okay, so this gives us a picture already of kind of maybe the age of the character, the age of the person who lives here. I'm going to say that they're relatively young. I think that's safe to say. So let's open that because this looks like a good place to store some books. So let's pop that in. Uh, let's put it so it's upright, actually. There we go. So pop that in like that. Right, what comes out next? It's an adorable frog. Adorable frog, you can go over there for now, adorable frog. Right, there we go. So like a My Little sort of a pony type thing. Oh, what's that saying? Hang on, we can... Ah, we can rotate it round. Okay, well, let's put that there. That seems like a perfect fit for that little space there. That's quite good. Uh, and then we have a sort of a little sort of action figure type character. Let's put them over there because that seems like a good thing for them. Hang on, can anything go in the window? Oh, things can go in the window. Things can go in the window. You can go in the window. That's all exciting. Uh, and then we have a thing. I don't quite know what that is, like a monstery thing. It looks like it belongs with that character there. Hang on, can we move you over a bit? Yeah, there we go. We'll have whatever they are in the window. They look good. Um, ah, right. Then another horse. Right, hang on a second. We might want to change this round a bit. So you go there and you go there with your sort of My Little Pony-esque friends across there. And of course, you know, 1997. These things are all relevant. So here we go. A troll. There we go. <laughs> with, with wonderful hair. Um, we can put things in the bed if we want to. I kind of feel like these things belong more down here. So put that there. And then we've got whatever that thing is. We'll put you there. You look exciting. We'll, we'll put you there for now. That's all very good. And then, oh, it's a Tamagotchi. It's a Tamagotchi. There we go. Now, the idea is we put that there and we will see that. So we get out of bed, we come down the ladder, and then we look out the window and we see our Tamagotchi and we remember 
to go, you know, give it some food and clean it up and all that kind of stuff. But we won't do, will we? We won't do, because nobody remembered to go and feed their Tamagotchi for long, did they? They kind of did it for a while, and then they forgot. And also, if you don't know what a Tamagotchi is, if you're watching this and you're thinking, 1997, Tamagotchis, what are you talking about? Go, go and ask your parents or something. I don't know. Go and find, go and find an older person to ask. But uh, yeah, Tamagotchis uh, were, were big in 1997, and that's why we've bought one with us. Right. Oh, I remember you. I remember you, exciting duck, right? Exciting, cool duck. You can go on the bed because you seem to be like that. Ah, right. And then, and then you can go up on the bed as well. Adorable sort of pig. You can go on the bed as well. And then we have a drawing that we've made of the pig. Okay, we'll put that there. We'll pop that there. Can we put the drawing on the wall? No, no, we can't. Okay, never mind. Um, ah, right. Very important. Got to have some music. Um, yeah, let's put that right there. That'll do. And then we get... Ah, hang on. Right, is that tapes? Yeah, that's tapes. Hang on. Can we put that... Hang on. Move. Let's move the Tamagotchi over a bit. Froggy, move over there. You go there. Tapes next to that thing. Absolutely. So we can, uh, yeah, have a range of sort of music to play on that thing there. And then we've got another book. We'll just put the book into there. And another book. Yep, yeah, just pile the books in. Makes sense. And... Right, hang on. What is that? Can we zoom in? Uh, hang on. Zoom in. Oh, yeah, there we go. Right, that helps. Can we zoom in a bit? Um, looks a bit... Uh, I don't know. It looks a bit E.T.-esque. There's a thing going across the moon. I don't really know. I don't know what that might be. We'll, we'll put that in there for now. That's fine. And there we go. That box is done. Let's zoom out because that's a bit... <laughs> it's quite an extreme zoom. Um, let's start on this box then. So we have a ball. Okay, do you know what? Ball can just go in the corner. That's fine. And a bag. School bag, I imagine. Let's just pop that there. I'm imagining the door is sort of here. So they can sort of come that way and grab their school bag and get out the door. Um, ah, now here we go. This is, I like this. I like this. So we're getting a picture of what this person is all about. They like a bit of drawing. They like a bit of music. There is a football just there. And they have some sort of trophy for football. And yes, I'm saying football, not a soccer ball, because that's what it is. Because, um, you know, you kick it with your feet and everything. So, um, so yeah, there we go. We've got a trophy. So we are very good at this. Do you know what? That's going to go on the desk. Now, we can't really see it, but we know it's there. So here we go. And that is... Oh, that's like pencils and stuff. Hang on. So drawing supplies can go in there. That makes sense. And a ruler. Yep. Okay. That's all good stuff. Um, ah, right. Now that, that looks like a diary. It's got a little kind of uh, heart lock on it there. So, right. Okay. Let's put that in there. And maybe we need to... Is there a secret place where we can put that? Can we hide that? Can we hide it under our pillow or something? Just so you know, the responsible adults, the adults that are responsible for us, don't go and find this. Let's put it there. It's fine. They won't look in there. Of course they won't. Right, so some crayons. Okay, hang on. Um, can they fit in there? Can we rotate them around? Can we put them in like that? Yeah, they fit in there. We might have to move those if there are more books. Um, ah, right, okay. Ah, right, this is good. Can we stack that? Hang on, move that. Can we put that there and stack that on top? Yes, we can. Marvellous. Right, there's a big picture. I imagine that's going to go on the wall. That is of a horse. Yeah, okay. Let's put that there. I assume it's a horse. It's, it's a nice picture. It's very good. Uh, ah, right, so little sort of piggy bank. That can go there. And then we have uh, whatever that is. Oh, like a little sort of photo album type thing. Yeah, that slots in very nicely there. Right, a little game. We'll put that there. Uh, what is that again? Now, when we played this before, a few people did identify some of these items that I didn't. Is that like a spinning top of some description? Let's just put that there. That'll do. And then, ah, yes, a Rubik's Cube. <laughs> a thing that I've never, ever completed. And a little sort of waste paper bin thing. That'll do. Uh, ah, that's like a board game set type thing. Hang on. Let's move that up there. Let's move that just sort of out of the way. Yeah, that looks like it's going to have... Like, you know, checkers or backgammon or whatever in there. So, yeah, and chess and stuff. So, yeah, okay, that's good. And then that's another game. So, we'll put that there. Is that that box done? Yes, it is. Right, okay, and then we open the next box. That's another... What is that? That's a... I don't know what that is. It's just a big book. It must be a big book. We'll put it there. Um, right, scissors. That's part of our sort of art supply thing. That can go in there. Ah, right, there's a little sort of uh, eraser type thing which isn't fitting in the land of the art supplies. Ah, right, there's a drawer. 
Okay, right, yeah, that thing goes in the drawer. Obviously it goes in the drawer. Right, they can't go on top of there, unfortunately. Um, okay, hang on, hang on. Can we take them out? Can we put them on top of that? No, hang on, take that out. Can they fit in there? Can we put that on top of them? No, bother. Okay, never mind. Can we put that on top of anything else? Oh, that can go on top of there. I feel like that should go in its own place. Um, hang on, can we fit that in there now? Yes, perfect. There you go, a little bit of reorganisation. Okay, we've got a sort of adorable little sort of dragon thing. Uh, that can sit... Uh, where can that sit? I don't know. <laughs> where can you go, adorable cuddly dragon? Let's move that. Let's put you into the corner. Football seems a more important thing. Do you know what? Let's just put the football here. We're a child. This is too tidy. So that can go just there. Um, and then we've got... Ah, right, yes. This was, this was a poster, wasn't it? But a rolled up poster. So let's go up a bit. Let's have... That wonderful rainbow halo dog poster above our bed. Because that looks nice. Uh, and then we have uh, another book. Can we fit any more books in there? No. No, we cannot. Hang on, shut that a second. Do we move those things over a bit? Given we like drawing, maybe we get all the drawing supplies out and we put them on our desk. And that frees up room under there under that thing maybe we should do that right okay so the ruler can go there the pens can go there maybe the piggy bank thing can go in there scissors can go there and the eraser thing can go just there right marvelous and now we have more room for books so just pop that there and another book and <gasps> very important the most important thing in the room possibly it's a game boy okay do you know what we're gonna turn it so it's, no, I quite like it like that, actually. I quite like it like that. So we've got a game, but oh, we've got so many amazing things. And we have a cat. We've got a cat with a little sort of, a little kind of, uh, you know, sort of train driver's cap on, which is good. Right, okay, you can go at the end of the bed. Um, that looks like a book of some description. That is, uh, that's, ooh. Ooh, I feel like I should click this button, although I don't quite know what's going to happen. Okay, we can take a picture. Ah, okay, right, there you go. We've got ourselves a little sort of picture thing set up. Oh, okay, that's fun. So we can just take sort of snapshots and things. Oh, and then we can we can put filters. Oh, look, we can, <laughs> we can make it all sorts of crazy looking. Okay, fine, fine. It's like Instagram, but in 1997. Okie dokie, right. Yes, leave photo mode, thank you. Um, let's put the camera down here, because that's exciting. Um, a torch, very important. Let's put the torch just there. Um... And then what else is there? Another one of those, like a book. There's a little sort of car bus thing. Okay, we'll just pop that on the shelf. And a skipping rope. Okay, that's that's kind of important. That's sort of a big deal. Where can we put that? Um, I mean, is there room in there now? I think there might be. Yeah, we'll put that in there. Oh, and there we go. And that is it. So there we go. So we've sort of unpacked that box. And now we know what this person's life was like in 1997. So here we go. Now the football is kind of glowing. So let's click the football. Ah, this doesn't go here. Okay. It's not happy with it being over there in an untidy way. We had to put it over there. There we go. So the game is happy. We get a shiny, spinny, happy star, which is all very good. Okay. So on to the next we go. And look at that. There we go. Oh, that's nice. I like that. Yay. Okay. Exciting things are happening. And it looks like, there you go, May 1997. Finally, my own room. Okay, so we have our own little room here. Um, I imagine that's, is that a replay of what we just did, possibly? Um, I don't know, I'm going to go and press it and see what happens. Yes, it is. Look, we can have a quick playback of how we set the room up. Oh, that's very exciting. Okay, there we go. I mean, that's how we did that room then. I like that. Look at that, the sunshine beaming through. Okay, so finally, my own room. So in May 1997, we were old enough to have our own room with all sorts of exciting things in and games and gadgets and other fun things. So, okay, right. So where do we go next from there then? What happened? So 2004, so hang on a minute. That is Math with Penge. That is seven years into the future. And here we go. So we're now in this little sort of, I mean, I say little, it's bigger than the room we just had. Um, and there's a chair and desk and a kind of big wardrobe -y thing. There's a monitor, some shelves over there, and a bed. Okay, right, and there's a few scuff marks on the floor. There's a bit of a rug down there. I imagine that's where the door is, because that seems to jut out a bit, possibly. I don't really know, but here we go. So, um, it looks like 
We have a computer monitor there. So let's let's move that over and look at this. It's a proper <laughs> it's a proper ye olde CRT monitor. Again, if you don't know these, ask your parents, but they're wonderful. I like those. Oh, hang on, what's that? What's that? Ah, yes. Okay, right. So there is our bedroom in this place we live, but we've got a bit over here. We have a little kitchenette area with a sink and a microwave and a fridge freezer and a kind of bin under there. And we've got the bathroom as well. And then back to the bedroom. Okay, I mean, this box on the bed is going to be a bit annoying. So let's open that first. Let's go through this. So that looks like a poster. Um, yeah, okay, we'll put that on the wall in there. That's fine. Right, books. Where are we going to put books? I mean, okay, we have some shelves. That would be good for kind of books and such, wouldn't it? Let's pop those up onto there. Um, that looks like a slightly chonkier sort of book. So we'll put that there. And then, ah, right. And then we have some sort of art supplies. Okay, so we're still big. We're still big into art then, I assume. Because we did like drawing before, didn't we? They look a little bit fancier. We've upgraded from, you know, sort of crayons and things. Okay. And then we've got, again, right. I'm not going to identify what all these things are. Hang on. Zoom in. And go and have a look at what they are. I don't know what they are. What is this? <laughs> Uh, I imagine it's an art supply of some description. There's probably people going, it's really obvious what it is, Penge. I don't know what that is. Right, another book thing. So that can go up there. That's fine. And I assume that's a book of like a somebody dancing or whatever. So there we go. We'll pop that up there. And there we go. A box is done. Nice and sorted. Do you know what, though? Very important. Let's get this room done first because we need to find the kettle. It's always the last thing you pack, the kettle. So then when you arrive at your new place, you get the kettle out first and you make some lovely tea. So here we go. Let's have a look at the kitchen. So a mug. Very important. Must have mugs within easy access. Another mug. That doesn't seem to have a handle. Okay. Bit weird. Oh, yes. Now we're talking. A proper lovely teacup. Very nice. Right. Sugar. Could that go... Possibly up there, maybe. So sugar up there. And that is... Oh, that's some sort of lovely biscuit barrel. Oh, I like that. Hang on, that might have to go just there with the sugar behind it, possibly. Um, okay, a plate. That can go there. A bowl. That can go there. Another bowl can stack into the bowl. And a plate can go on the plate. And there we go. Right, so another box down. Very good. Let's go into here. That's a kind of tea towel thing. So can we... Hang that on anything? Oh, there. There we go. There's an obvious hanger thing. Um, okay, right. Cutlery. That's going to go into one of these. So let's put that... Uh, I don't know, let's put that there. That'll do. Got any more cutlery? That's knives. Hang on. Can we turn them round? <laughs> there we go. So knives. And that is... Teaspoons, is it? That might be like little teaspoons. And we've got another one of those. Um, okay. Oh, we can put it up there, look. We can put things right on the top if we want to. Doesn't seem the best, does it? Hang on, hang on. We've got another drawer there. Can we just sort of uh, pop some stuff into there? There we go. Right, so that, all right. That's sort of washing up. And that's hand soap. Is that hand soap? Uh, there's the washing up liquid. Right, marvellous. That is like sort of insect spray stuff. So we'll tuck that at the back of that thing. Um, and then we've got, oh, then very exciting. Like a sort of a sandwich toaster thing. A toasty maker... Um, chopping board. Can we prop that up anywhere? Can we prop that up somewhere? I don't think we can. Game isn't happy about that. Let's put it on the floor for now. Uh, right, pots and pans. We've not got a lot of room, have we? Um, hang on. Can we just leave that on the hob for now? And a gigantic pan. Okay, right, hang on. We'll, we'll try and tuck that into the back of there. Um, and then we've got some... What is that? Oh, like cooking oil. Olive oil type stuff. Okay, so we'll have that at the back of there. Maybe, hang on, hang on, hang on. That's like tea and coffee making facilities. This can be sort of, you know, ingredients and things. Um, that is, uh, what is that? Oh, that's for the bin. That's for the, oh, hang on. We can't shut, oh, that's quite nice. We can't shut the door because the stuff's in the way. <laughs> that's quite nice touch. Yeah, that's for the bin. Um, okay, can that go in there? Can we rotate that round and pop that in there? Lovely. And, um... Oh, yeah, are they sponges? They might be sponges, possibly. We'll, we'll put them in there as well. And that is... Ah, right, that's a kind of spatula cooking utensil thing. So put that in there. And another box done. Where is the kettle? Oh, I'm, I'm getting the sweats. Um, 
that's a keyboard not not often used in the uh not often used in the kitchen but okay let's uh <laughs> let's put the keyboard over there back to the kitchen we go thank you right another plate and another bowl and a glass okay we're gonna have to do some rejigging here that can go down there for now right that mug without the um the handles can go there then that one can go there then the tea mug, right, the tea cup, so it can go there. Then other drinking receptacles can go sort of uh, there, like that. Just be really careful when you're going for biscuits. Don't knock that off. Cookie, sorry, whatever. Right, gigantic big stabby knife. Uh, where does gigantic big stabby knife live? Uh, I, mean, I mean, it should really go in a drawer somewhere, I kind of feel. But I think the drawers are full of other things. Okay, we'll leave it there for now. Gigantic big stabby knife. Right, and then a wooden spoon. Ah, wooden spoon can go just there. That's very good. Ah, that's a... Uh, ah, right, yes, we have ourselves. Hang on, can we put that on the side? Big stabby knife can go in there. I feel like, I feel a bit safe with big stabby knife in there. Um, Yeah, okay, tin opener. Tin opener can go in there. That's fine. Uh, and a sponge, that can go just there to do the dishes. Oh, thank goodness. <laughs> Praise V, the kettle has been uncovered. <laughs> right, okay. Get the kettle near to a plug socket. That's very important. That's a boot. Okay, right. So, boot. Uh, we'll chuck in there for now. That's fine. Right, back over to the kitchen. That is... Uh, hang on. I don't quite know what that is. What is that? That is... I don't know what that is. <laughs> a thing. Is it a like a peeler of some sort? I don't know what that is. We're going to put it in there for now and hope that's right. Right, okay. So a, cu a cup with a handle. That's important. I like that. Right, another kind of drinking glass. That's fine. Right, a smaller plate. Crikey, we haven't got much room, have we? Right, and then a kind of a little sort of tea plate thing. Oh, hang on a minute. Hang on. No, no, no. I can't, I can't have the mixed up. <laughs> that's, that's not going to sit well. There we go. Very good. Um, salt. Yep, so oil and salt can go at the back. Then we've got, oh, oh, this is, this is, this is loose leaf tea. That's what that is. It's loose leaf tea. Um, and then we've got some, right, so kitchen roll stuff can go under there. That's fine. Ah, I suspected they might appear. So away with you wooden spoon and in you come normal spoons. So can we, hang on, right, pick that up, put that there, grab that, put that under there with those under there. And then, hang on, hang on, pick that up, put that there. Right, so the sponges can live under there as well. And then we'll turn that around. And this can be for all the other things, whatever that thing is. <laughs> Not quite sure what that is. Uh, put that in there. And then we just need sugar. So sugar and that can go there. Uh, okay, so is that that box done? Yes, it is. Right, so, thank you, And then we've got the chopping board. Um, I don't want to put it on the top. That's a bit of a weird place for a chopping board, isn't it? It's a bit of an odd place. I mean, we can't just leave it on the floor because that's a bit of a nonsense, isn't it? Can we open the fridge? Uh, no, no, we can't open the fridge. Okay, never mind. Can we just prop it up? Um, I mean, it sort of makes sense for it to go on the side, I guess. Okay, right. So let's go and clear another bedroom box. We're trying to do this bit by bit. So, okay, right. Art supplies. We'll put them under there for now. And that's a little sort of book. And that's another small book. That's a mouse. Right, important. Go with computer. That's, uh, oh, that's the mouse pad. <gasps> a mouse mat. Oh my goodness me, it looks very, it looks very colorful and exciting. Okay, right, a ruler that can go in there. Can we move that? Ah, splendid. Right, okay, yeah, we can move that around. So put the ruler to the front, put those into the corner, put those sideways on like that, put whatever those things are just there, because I'm not sure. Um, right, another journal thing. I think what we'll do is we'll leave that there because there is something there. There's a bedside table there that we can't quite see. Right, another chunky book and another one of those. And that gets rid of that. Yes, there. Bedside table has become visible. Okay, let's open this one. Right, a huge big bag. That can just go down there for now. In fact, you know what? Can it can it tuck under there? Oh, it's perfect. Okay, and then we've got... Uh, that looks like... Oh, yeah, that's like a sort of uh, an MP3 playing device. It's a music device. Uh, let's put that on there. That's a shirt, which we will hang up. Hang on, can we put the hanger on the rail? There we go, that makes sense. Uh, another shirt, we'll hang that up. And some 
jeans. They can go at the top. The jeans can go at the top. Oh, the little piggy banks come with us. That's nice. And I like that look. That's, you know, we've brought the art stuff with us and we've brought the little piggy bank with us. Marvellous. Right, another t-shirt. Wow. <laughs> that's that's very exciting. That's an exciting t-shirt. And we've brought a little kind of figurine with us. Yes. Yes, I like that. Right, so those, they can go there. And the ball, of course. Let's put the ball under the desk for now. And right, that looks important. That looks like a notebook. That looks like an important sort of thing. So we'll hang that up. Meow. Okay, nice. And there we go. Right, now we can open and close this. So that, I imagine, belongs in there. Some sort of journal type thingamajig. Can't quite shut the drawer again, unfortunately. It can't. I can't click the front of the drawer. And now we've opened another box. Okay, let's go through this box. Right, a picture that I assume we drew. Let's put that there. And then we've got... Oh, we've got the cuddly pig. There you go, cuddly pig. You've come with us as well. Uh, ah, right, that's a toothbrush. I think that should go in here, like so. Back we go to this box. Let's sort this out. We'll go and do the bathroom in a second. Oh, hang on, that's toothpaste. <laughs> We've not packed this very well, have we? Okay, so toothbrush, toothpaste, where they should be. Any more bathroom things? No, it's like an arty mannequin thing. We'll put that there. That's fine. Ah, right. Here we go. Now we're getting into slightly more modern tech. There we go. So look, it can play CDs now. We've upgraded from tapes. Um, okay. And a shoe. And... Ah, right. That's... Right, hang on a minute. That's got CDs in. So let's move all the books up there. Uh, book. Oh, these are... Oh, this is all over the shop. Hang on a minute. Hang on. Move the books like that. Move that book to the end. Put that there. And then we've got the CDs next to the thing that plays the CDs. There's the other uh, the other shoe, trainer, whatever it is. I'll put that there and that there. Okay. What else in this box? And a huge big boot. Okay. So, uh, yeah, that can go. Can they tuck in here? I don't think I think we can fit one more in. I don't think we've got the angle to do that. No, never mind. Um, do you know what? Can we just put them under, move the ball out of the way? Can we put them there? Just sort of tuck them round there. Yeah, okay, right. And then get rid of that box. Marvellous, right. Then shut that drawer. Yay, splendid. Right, we've got some room down there as well. We've got some room down there. Can we put the football in there? Yay. Um. Okay, so do you want to figure out the final three boxes here? How many boxes are in the bathroom? Just one. Okay, let's go and do the bathroom. So a towel. Hang on the towel rail. Uh, that is, that's some soap. Uh, okay, right, hang on, hang on, hang on. Where can we put... There's not, there's not a lot of room on there, is there? Come on, you could you could put that next to that. Come on, go. <laughs> the soap I kind of feel needs to go there, but then that can. Oh no, that can fit on the side. That's fine. That's good. Um, then we have a little. Hang on, can we put can we put that in there? Yes, can we put that in there? Perfect. Oh, it it is a. Hang on, hang on. That the handle is on the on the right. I'm imagining our person is is right-handed, so that's fine. That's much better. Oh, I like that. That's better. Um, that is sort of... Oh, that's like antiperspirant deodorant stuff. That can probably go there. Can we turn the shower on and stuff? Does that... Does it allow us to do that? No. Can we flush a toilet or anything? Oh, yeah, we can flush the toilet. That's exciting. Uh, yeah, we need some loo roll at some point. Um, there we go. Like perfume, smelly spray, hairbrush. Um, I mean, does this necessarily go in here? We brush out... Oh, that's where the mirror is, actually. Is there a mirror in here? No. Okay. Yes, we would brush our hair in here. So we'd leave that on the side as well. It's a very busy side. Right, that is some sort of shampoo conditioner thing. So that can go there. Right, first aid kit. That can go in there. So we know where it is. And then we've got... Right, then we have a bra. Okay, that does not belong in the bathroom. Not typically. So hang on a minute. Hang on. That can go into there. Because I don't quite know where else to put them. So that will do for now. We'll, we'll put it down there for now. That's all good. Right, here we go. And then we've got... Right, so a box of tampons can go in here. Because that seems a logical place. And then we've got shampoo or conditioner. Whatever that one isn't. And this one is. We'll just put it next to it. There we go. Right, toilet roll. Very important. Hugely important. Uh, more toilet roll put down there. And a big fluffy towel. Uh, ah, right, yes, it can hang off there. Right, I see, I see. 
Right, and they are kind of sanitary pad things. They can go just like, can we turn them round? There we go, that's better. And there is still a bit of room in there. Um, ah, right, and there's the, oh, hang on. We might want to move that. Let's put that in there because that's your kind of sanitary bin thing. So we'll put that there. And then we've got a pan. Okay. <laughs> Not really one of those in the bathroom, but right you are. Um, oh, crikey. Hang on a second. Oh, no. Move that out of the way. Can we fit a pan into here? Um, no. No, we cannot. Oh, hang on. Right. The sponges can go there. Can we fit the pan in now? Can we fit that pan in? No. Can we fit it up there? Mm, no. Okay. The pan might have to... Hang on. Can the pan live... Uh, hang on. Hang on. Move. Move that there. Can the pan live somewhere on... Hang on. Why can't the pan live on the side? Pan, go on the side. It has got a hangy thing. It's got like a hook on it, which would imply that you could hang it from something, but I don't think we've got anything to hang it from. Okay, never mind. Right, and then can we fit that... Ah, there we go. There we go. Hang on. Turn it around. Splendid. Okay, yeah, that'll do. Happy with that. Right, so back to the bathroom. Ah, splendid. Done. Okay, let's shut, shut the door. Let's be nice. There we go. Door's shut. And back to bedroom. Uh, okay, tall box. Ooh, okay. Right. Computer. Ye olde computer from ye olden times. Um, right, that would kind of typically go on the floor. Hang on. Boots. Those boots are made for moving. Right, there we go. So that's, we'll connect that up. We'll get some wires, I'm sure, from somewhere. Um, okay, let's put the boots across there then. That'll do. And that box is done. Okay, that was all that was in that. Just the computer tower. Okay, fine. And this one here. Right, more undergarmentage going on. More undergarmentage, but different colour. Very important. Oh my goodness me, so much undergarmentage. Right, and a poster. Okay. Let's put that there. Let's move that picture over a bit. Okay, that'll do. Can we open that? Oh, hang on. I didn't mean to put that there. Um, that is... That's a Game Boy. That can go That can go on the edge there. Can we open that box as well? Just see what's in here. Ah, more kind of clothing stuff. Um, okay, right. So that can go down there. That is a little sort of alarm clock thing. So that would make sense if it went by the bed. Although it's flashing 12. You've got to plug it in. It's going to run out of battery. Um, okay, and then we've just got piles of... Hang on, that's a T-shirt. Let's put that there. Um, that's a T-shirt. Pop that on top of the other one. That's... I kind of feel like that needs to be hung up. This t-shirt here can go down there. That can go down there. That needs to be hung up. That's nice. I like that. So that can go across there. We've got our little sort of red truck thing we bought with us from home. That's nice. Um, okay. A wooden Eiffel Towery thing. And then we've got... Right, hang on. I think the t-shirts all need to go in a big pile. T-shirts into a pile with you and then hanging up things. Hang on. Oh, no, hang on. Is that pyjamas? That might be pyjamas. They might be PJs. Um, yeah, let's put them on the bed. They might be pyjamas. That's fine. Um, that probably needs hanging up. We'll hang that up. Um, are they are they spare pyjamas? Uh, okay, do you know what? No, it's fine. They can go up here. Pyjamas can live up there. That's a good thing. There we go. Hooray for pyjamas. Um, and then we've got... Right, now, again, I'm trying to remember what we did with the demo with these. These are socks. These are socks. These are socks in a bundle. Right, okay, so hang on, zoom out again. Um, and there we go, we're gonna have many different types of these, and one there, and okay, toilet paper. Who packed this? <laughs> Who packed all our stuff? Is that outrageous? Right, there we go, and back to the bedroom, and nope, didn't mean to press that button, meant to press the box. Right, another book, that can kind of tuck up there. And, ah, right, there's the little sort of photo album that we carry around with us. So we'll put that there. And that's a t-shirt. So that can go onto there. And then we have, right, more jeans. They can go there. And the box is done. Right, we're down to the final box. Although this thing is sitting on the floor looking a little bit untidy. Um, can we put it by there for now? Uh, right, we have, oh, we've, we've got train driver kitty. That's very exciting. Okay. And then we have, uh, whatever that is, like a little book. Uh, right, more art stuff. There's your eraser thing. Ah, right. Okay, we have a big thing, like an art case thing. Can that just sort of sit in the corner? Will the game allow us to have that? Oh, crikey, hang on a minute. More of these things. Socks or pants or whatever they are, sort of nicely. Hang on, hang on. We can, we can mix and match them, look. They can match. Oh, yeah, that's much tidier. I like that. 
Um, yeah, they've got a little bows on. How lovely. Right, and a... Okay. A toaster. Right. Uh, <laughs> okay. How are we going to fit a toaster into the kitchen? Hang on. That can go up there. The toaster can go at the back near to the kettle. But then where's this? That's just going to have to live on there. It's a, it's a little bit it's a little bit untidy, but it will do the job. Uh, right, more of these. I don't think we've got a match for those right now. Purple one like that. The evil Rubik's Cube that I can't do. That can go on there. More underpantage. Hang on, pop that there. Pop that there. They're very nicely sort of rolled up. That's very impressive. Uh, ooh, some yellowy sort of golden ones. Very fancy. And a t-shirt that says dance. That's one with a pointy finger. Do you know what? That can hang up. When you walk in, you can be inspired to bust some moves. And then a little picture. And oh, that can go on the wall. Okay, no, that's fine. We'll put that above that one. Ooh, but possibly slightly more central. Oh, we can't have it central. Oh, I don't like that without it being central. Let's put it just there. There we go. That'll do. This might be the last thing out of here. Um, more pants. Oh, hang on a minute. Now the right, gold pants go down there. Those ones, stripy pants, go there. And then we've got... Oh, then we've got purple pants. Uh, okay, hang on. Gold pants move. Purple pants or socks, or whatever you are. And there we go. Right. It's not happy with a few things. Right, it doesn't like the... Right, okay, right. We've got we've got to do some, some readjustments here. The sandwich toaster isn't really going to be used very often, is it? The toasty maker. You use that quite sparingly. So that can go up there. That frees up this bit here to do food prep and what have you. Bathroom, I think, is okay don't think anything is flashing on and off in the bathroom so that's fine i think the kitchen is okay but the bedroom is clearly not good right the pajamas is not happy with the pajamas <laughs> it is not happy with those at all right can we tuck them under there are they okay to go under there no it really doesn't like that okay do you know what pajama no not on the jeans pajama pile there we go right and yeah the art supplies it's not happy with the art supplies I don't know where else they could possibly go. Could we put them on top of there? No. Sorry, happy with the art stuff. That's full of bras. So we're going to do too much with that. Can we put the boots? Hang on. Can we put the boots down there? Is that an acceptable position for boots? So if we put the boots out of the way, that thing can go next to them. Um, I don't quite know what I've achieved by doing that there. <laughs> Not much, I think, is the answer. We haven't really got a Oh, hang on, hang on. Uh, no, not that. Can the art things go under there? Is that acceptable for art things? I think. Is that it? Game, are we okay? Are we all right? Get under the football. Okay, but hang on a second. Though. Hang on. We might want to move those things. Hang on, hang on, hang on. What can we fit in there? Can we fit that in there? No. I kind of want that to look a little bit neater. Can that fit in there at all? No. Botherations, that can't fit in there in any way, shape or form. That's not very good, is it? Okay, that's going to have to go over there then. Then that's going to have to go there. The rubber thing can go in there. The ruler can go in there as well. That's fine. Move that up, put that kind of there. The book can go back into there. Shut that and the football can go on the chair. No, it can't go on the chair. It can go in the cupboard. <laughs> there we go. Who keeps a football in the cupboard? Um, okay, do you know what though? We have got a hanger spare. So why don't we hang our sort of hoodie thing? There we go. Very good. Right, so that's all sorted. Another shiny star thing. So now let's click on the shiny star. Let's see what happens. And there we go. Oh, right. So we've got a graduation-y kind of thing there. So this is us at university, I would assume. Classes start Monday. Uni, here I come. Okay, right, let's do this. Let's watch the quick playback thing. I like this. This is very good. There we go. So kitchen being done. And then we've have to back with that drawer for ages. <laughs> there we go. So there. And then bedroom starts unpacking. Stuff on shelves. Flicking around the place. Bathroom getting sorted. And then PC going in. Boxes being undone. Final little sort of tweaks. Trying to fit everything in. Sort the sandwich toaster out. And boom. Splendid. And there we go. The command to dance is there as you enter the room. Okay, right, so that's January 2004. Now, I can't quite recall where the demo left off. It might have been just there. That might have been kind of it. So here we go. Let's sort of delve a bit further on and see what's next. So where do we go? 2007, so three years on from the last one we saw. And 
Okay, right, so let's have a look at this. There is a sewing machine, and there is kind of a thing here that looks like we're sort of working on it. So are we some sort of like a seamstress or whatever? I don't know what the word is. We're a sewing person. We can make clothes. However, we... Oh, I like this. Oh, this is very exciting. Right, so we like making clothes. That's good. That's a good skill to have. I can't do anything like that. So that's very impressive. However, we do seem to be a bit of a geek. Hooray, because we've got geeky toys. Look at that. There's kind of like a whatever that is up there. There's board games. There's some, I don't know, some sort of like console games. I know there's a console. Ha! However, they might not necessarily be ours. Maybe we've moved in with somebody else and this is all their stuff. So we bought some of our stuff and then, I mean, there are some boxes and what have you and a lovely rug thing to unroll. And I kind of noticed that's flashing on and off. Oh. Oh, there are many rooms. Okay. <laughs> Right, here we go. Oh, look at that. That's exciting. Is that is that a New Zealand thing? I, I'm not entirely sure. I know, whatever. Right, so we have many... Oh, there's... Oh, my goodness me. There's so much stuff to unpack. Um, Yeah, look, look, there's stuff already here. There's stuff already here. So we're moving in with somebody else, I think. Uh, Okay, that's fine. Now, we don't know if we're moving in in a sort of, you know, relationship capacity or a you know, housemate capacity just yet, but... Okay, right, let's sort the bathroom out then, because this has got one box in it. So, right, toothbrush. Where's the mug we bought? Toothbrush, toothpaste. Um, what's that? Oh, a, a razor. Right, yes, yeah, so like, you know, for shaving and stuff. That is... Uh, I don't know what that is. <laughs> what is this? Uh, okay, right, hang on a minute, hang on. Have we got any drawer space? No. Yes, right, okay, let's put some stuff in there. So a drawer can go in there. Uh, a drawer can go in there? No, a hairbrush can go in there. That would be better. Um... Hang on, zoom in, zoom in, zoom in. What's that? Uh, I don't know what that is. I can't quite work that out. And then we've got a bag of toiletries, I would assume. Is that a bag of toiletries? Oh, I don't know what that is either. There are many mystery items. Do you know what? We'll just we'll pop that there for now. <laughs> uh, actually, can that go up there? I don't know what that is, but it's it can go up there now. It's fine. That is... Uh, hang on, I don't know what that, I'm trying to find, let's just put, like, empty the box, hang on, empty the box away. That's a loofah, that can hang in, hang on, open the shower, that can hang in there, there we go. Um, wow, they're, they're industrial sized tubs of, like, shampoo or whatever they are, or body wash, wow. Um, okay, we'll put ours in, <laughs> our meagre looking ones, nicely we're sticking with the same brand, that's good, brand loyalty. Oh, a new shiny thing. Um, right, okay, so we've got the sanitary pads back. So let's put them into there. And, right, the tampons. Can we fit them into there? There's something already in there. Can they fit into that gap? There? Yay, splendid. And then some sort of spray. Spray thing. Um, okay, hang on. Ooh, hang on. Can we open that? Can things fit in there? That's way too big. Absolutely not. Um, not that. Uh, okay, hang on. Can it go on that side? Yes, it can go there. Right, so get rid of the box. We haven't got our little cup yet for the um, for the toothbrush and toothpaste and such. Um, hang on. So in this drawer, can we put that? Can we put our sort of perfumey stuff? Put the razor into that drawer. That's fine. We'll put whatever they are. <laughs> I don't know whatever this is. What? What is? Hang on. Hang on. Uh, it's got a. Oh, it's a. It's a uh, nail clippy thing. That's what it is. Oh, that can go in the drawer. Right. I've figured it out. Um, I don't know what that is. What's that? Oh, I don't know what some of these things are. Do you know what? It can go in the drawer and it's all fine. There we go. <laughs> sort of put things away. Right, splendid. Um, over to the kitchen and somebody needs to do the dishes because that's a bit of a state. Uh, okay, right. We've bought our mo- There's not a lot of room. We don't have a lot of room for our own stuff anymore. Um, right, a towel can hang off there. Yay, there we go. Right, a little blue cup with a handle, very important. Um, another one of those. Can we put it in here somewhere? Can we put it in there somewhere? Ah, right. There's some room over. Oh, there's so much, so many drawers for things. Oh, hang on. That can go into there. Then we've got that peeler thing again. Hang on a minute. Shove that out of the way. That can go in there. That's fine. We'll leave that in there. We can share that. Right, cookie jar, very important. Lovely food. Sugar. Uh, right, the person's already got some sugar who's here, but we'll put it next to their sugar thing. Right, oil, that can go over there. That makes sense. Big stabby knife. Right, big stabby knife. 
Where can you go? Into there? No, no you cannot. Into here? No you cannot. Hang on, move that out of the way. Big stabby knife fits into that. There. there we go. Right, move that out of the way. I don't know what that is. What's that there? I can't work out what that is. Right, I think that drawer is full. Um, and then we've got... Uh, what's that? <laughs> and a little star and a heart. Okay, oh, they're, they're fridge magnets. Of course, they're fridge magnets. There we go. And whatever that is. So a koala. And there's uh, sort of a kiwi and some fruit. And uh, that, that that's like a New Zealand thing, isn't it? Okay, right, let's open this. So what else have we got? Right, plate. plate. We're just going to stack our plates on top of the other person's plates. Sorry, other person. We've got a huge pile of plates and many bowls and little tiny plates. Um, uh, right, where can these live? Can we not move? Oh, we can't move the other person's stuff. Okay, let's put... Do you know what we'll do? Do you know what we'll do? The cups can go on that shelf, which I think is probably where they're supposed to go anyway. And they can go... Oh, hang on. Can it pile on there? Ah, that might be where they're supposed to go. Right, pile that up. Don't know what that is. Bottle of something. That'll do... Oh, it's like a reusable drinks bottle. Oh, that's good. Go environment. That's very good. Oh, not this pan again. <laughs> Away with your pan. Um... Okay, that's bathroomy. Let's hang that on there. Very good. Back to here. Uh, ah, right, the sandwichy toaster thing. That can go up there. And right, kill the bug spray stuff. That can go just there. Then we've got a first aid kit, which I think should belong in the bathroom, possibly. Although we've got no room for it in the bathroom. Ah. Um. Okay, Could it? can it live up there? Yes, that'll do. We'll just park it anywhere. Just go anywhere, first aid kit. Uh, right, sponges, they can sort of go into that gap. No, they can't. They can go at the back in there. And then, right, one of those, uh, like a spatula. Have we got any hangy things to hang it off? No, we have not. Right, okay, let's find some space in here. Uh, we'll put it there for now. That'll do. And a wooden spoon. That can't fit anywhere either. <laughs> It's the big stabby knife. That's the problem. The big stabby knife is the problem. Hang on. Can we move that? Put that in there. Yes. Perfect. That can go in sideways. Ah, oh, it is glorious. Right. And then the chopping board can go there. <gasps> that is very good. Okay. So shut all the things. You know, let's try and keep it as tidy as we can. So kitchen done. Bathroom done. Okay. And let's shut that. I mean, we might come back. There might be extra things packed somewhere where there shouldn't be. So we'll come back. But for now, oh yeah, a little sort of cup. Our little cup thing is not quite located yet, is it? Um, okay. Oh, there's so <laughs> there are so many things. Uh, okay. There's a room. There's how, hang on. How many rooms have we got to actually now sort out? So we've got this room here, which is where we are. Right. Yeah. We're in a shared house. We are in a shared house because this is our room in the shared house. We've got a, we've upgraded. We've got a fancy monitor now. Um, and that looks like the dining room. And that is the kind of living sort of area just there. Okay, right. This is good. This is good. At least we know what's going on. So we're growing up a bit and we've moved into a shared house. Don't quite know what we're doing in life right now, but that's absolutely fine. Um, okay, let's open up this box. Let's see what there is. There are some book type thing so we'll just get I imagine there's gonna be loads of these so we'll just get all the books out we have got a little nerdy figure which is fine because there are many nerdy figures and i love it right put that there uh that is that's quite big i don't really know what that is but it's big whatever it is ah that can just live under there and we have a bit of clothing which is going to have to go into the bedroom onto oh we have many hangers Joe, you know that can go in there for now that's fine right come back this way is that that box done already oh that was nice and easy okay right open this box right massive picture of oh it looks very exciting it looks like some sort of D, D exciting action poster okay and then right controllers can go down there <gasps> oh that it's just the thing of beauty. Can we just can we just appreciate this a moment, everybody, ladies and gentlemen? It looks like it. Well, okay, it, it clearly isn't a GameCube for copyright reasons, but it looks very much like a GameCube 
Oh, I love my GameCube. I still have my GameCube. It is a thing of wonder. I, I love my GameCube. Monkey Ball on that. It's been so long. Smash Brothers and Monkey Ball on the GameCube. And Double Dash. Ah, oh, brilliant stuff. Right, there we go. So we've got one of those. So, right. So now we've got controllers for it as well. So we're just loading this up with nerdery. Right, these look like the games for that, possibly. So we'll put them in there, look. Oh, hang on. Can we put them in there? Let's put them over there. Saves a bit of space under there, doesn't it? Um, yeah, that can go into there. That is a, a rug of some description. What, what is this? Uh, right, a thing. I don't know what that is. Another game, but we're out of room. So I'll start loading up down there. Right, box out the way. Ooh, there's something just there. Okay, that's a picture of... Uh, like a sort of person dancing with... Oh, no, they're doing a spell. They might be casting a spell. Or they're having a dance. I'm, I'm not entirely sure. One or the other. Both are good. Uh, right, that's going to be... Do they want that in this room? Or are they going to want that? Is that for our room? I'm not 100% sure. Hang on, move that out of the way. Can that fit into there? Yes, okay. So let's just put that up there, then. That'll do. Right, and then we've got... Oh, no! <laughs> not you, gigantic cooking pot. Gigantic, awkward-to-store cooking pot. Uh, oh, no, you might be right. Oh, it's fine. Loads of room in there. Um, okay, next thing is a book, possibly. And... Possibly another book, because I'm not entirely sure. Ah, and then a game called Rascal. That book is not flush with the others. That's going to annoy me. There we go. So the only thing is, I don't know what to do with this. <laughs> what is this? I don't know what that is. It's like a rug. It's like a lovely, comfy looking sort of rug or a blanket, possibly. I mean, do we, do we want to keep that somewhere else? Does that go in our bedroom? I don't know. I don't know. Let's do this room. Let's do this room here. Right, so... Uh, book thing, just there. That can go on top of there. Another book. That can go there. I don't quite know what that is. Can it fit anywhere? Um, we'll stand them up just there. That's fine. Right, another one of those. Ah, they look like they're in a part of a series. They're in kind of a series of things. Uh, and then we've got a little sort of figure... Ah, that would go well on there, look. There we go. We're matching the figurine set things. Okay, this is good. Uh, and then we'll stand that up there. I don't quite know what that is, but there we go. Right, so one of those goes. Yeah, look, they're 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 D and Ding. They're <laughs> they're D and D nerding. They've got a dice tower and they've got character sheets and they've got some dice. Oh, this is wonderful. I'm living my best life. Um, yeah, you can go there. That's fine. I like that. Weird Eiffel Tower thing can go just there. Oh, the little red bus that we bought with us from when we were tiny. Oh, I like that. There we go. That can go up there. Um, leaning tower, so just sort of world landmark type things. Uh, another book. Hang on, hang on. Can that go back over here? Can we tuck that into there? It can't go on that shelf. Is it? it can go just there, though. That'll do. That's fine. Right, and then, oh, and there's a big chunky looking book. Okay, right, hang on. Chunky book can go just there. And then thin book... Oh, thin book, go at the end. That's fine. It looks a bit untidy, but it will do the job. It's all fine. Right, and then, oh, we've got adorable kind of kitty thing. We've got train driver kitty. Train driver kitty, you're with us. Don't you worry, train driver kitty. We'll never abandon you. Okay. <laughs> we've got a chicken. Uh, the chicken can go there with the other animals. Okay, now we've got a baby chicken. Hang on, can that one go down there with its with its children? Okay, that's a bit weird, but right, well, that can go there. And then we have, quite sure what that is, a picture of a plant, possibly. Do you know what? It can go there. Yay for the picture of the plant. Okay, so that's that sorted. That room is done. Kitchen is done. Let's shut the doors to be polite and tidy. That room, possibly needs a bit of work with them. Um, with the toothbrush and the toothpaste there. I need a, a mug of some sort to put on there. But we'll sort that out in a sec. Right, here we go. There are many things in here. However, first thing to do, proper actual screen. Put it over there. And this is going to be the computer. We've still got ye olde computer, however. Um, right, hang on. Can that... Ah, it goes in there. It goes in the little sort of in the little sort of nook for it. Okay, right. I okay, mean, that frees up quite a lot of stuff. Right, here we go. And the little sort of notebook thing. That could probably go in there, couldn't it? Don't know what that is. But it looks like it's a thing to go on a pin board. Uh, a book. A little notepad. That can go on the side. Ooh, a fancy notepad thing. I like them with the with the kind of fancy sort of strap thing. I like them. Um, 
Right, okay, drawing supplies. They can go up at the top there now. I'm still not entirely sure what they are. Uh, fancy, like, pastels or something? Because we seem to have a few of them now. Oh, look, we've got them all in different colours. That's very exciting. Right, and then the eraser thing. And the pens. They can go up there. And whatever that is. Some sort of calendar. Date reminder thing. I don't know. Open that and open that. Another book thing. Okay, we have we have many of that. Do you know what? Let's can we stack them up? Hang on, take you away. Oh, no, move you over there. Stack you up there. Stack you up there. Can we stack those up? That'd make life a bit easier. Um, that is that is unfortunate. We don't have a bedside table anymore. We'll just put that there for now. <laughs> That'll have to do. That can be pinned upon the board. It's a nice picture. That also looks like a thing to pin upon the board. That looks like a thing to pin up on the board. That is our... Right, that's like our sort of MP3 playing thingamajig. And a hanger. Oh, thank goodness. Thank goodness. Right, more hangers. <gasps> it's a D20. Oh, this is wonderful. Let the nerdery commence. I don't know what that is. That. Uh, some sort of fancy art tablet, possibly? I don't know what that is. And we've got the... Ma ah, yeah, the mouse. Ma Hang on, get rid of that box. Uh, right, there's the mouse. Hang on, mouse, face the right way. There we go. And key... Oh, botherations. Hang on, get rid of that. Keyboard. Go there. That might have to go up there, possibly. I'll have to put that there. Move that over. Move that over. Put that in that gap. Very good. Another journaly thing. That can go there. Empty that box. Shut that drawer. Things are looking good. Okay, so we have... Oh, my goodness. How many journaly books have we got? <laughs> Open that and open that. Let's take a thing from here. That is a poster. Three miles home. Out here. Okay, we'll put that on the wall. Another hanger. Very welcome. Right. Jeans. Hang on a minute. Hang on. What have we got on that side? Ah, shelves. Right. Okay. Jeans can go over there. This is fine. I like jeans being all sorts of like that. <gasps> a kind of frisbee thing. Uh, Yeah. That can put that... Oh, can it go on the top? Can't go on the top. Botherations. Can it go under the end of the bed? <laughs> no. Um, okay, let's put that in there for now. The game might complain about that, but there we go. Um, uh, what's that? That is... I don't know what that is. What is this thing here? It's a, a shoe? Is that a shoe, possibly? Yes, possibly. A weird, fancy-looking shoe. I'm not entirely sure that they're shoes, but okay. And then we've got... Uh... <laughs> What's that? Oh, it's a, it's a dice bag. It's a dice bag for the nerdery. Okay, yeah. Nerdery can go up there. Nerdery can go at the top there. Pride of place at the top. Um, There is a book of some description. We'll put that there. And another book. Okay, well, hang on, hang on, hang on. Can the books go on there? Uh, oh, the books can go on there. They can pile up at the top. That's fine. Pile the books up like that. Right, grab. <gasps> We've upgraded our gadget. We've got a Game Boy Advance now, whatever that is. Um, with cartridges to go in the Game Boy Advance. Yep, okay, that's good. And another book can go on the top. And another book can go on the top. <laughs> and do you know what? Another book can go on the top. Oh my goodness, me, who'd have thought it? Right, open that. So let's see what's in here. Ah, hat. Okay, put the hat in there. Right, here we go. Hang on, do they open? Ah, yes, right, good. Okay, so we have many of pants again. Right, let's do, do you know what? We're not going to be so organised with these. Um, oh, there's our important sort of little reminder, like photo album, memory book thing. Um, let's go throw all these in. These are all just, just underpants. They can go in there. Right, hang on. We can put them into there. So undergarmentage. That's not undergarment game. Um, that is, however, yay. Okay, purple with frilly bits of my goodness me. <laughs> is it hot in here? Um, right, okay. And that there. That is a bag that can go on there for now. That needs to go... Oh, hang on a minute. I've got the drawer open. <laughs> open that. That can hang up on that just there. That can probably hang up just there. That's all fine. That can hang up. That's quite nice. I like that. And that needs to hang up as well. Although it can't. That can just go on the floor. It's fine. What is this? Some sort of apron. Okay. <laughs> and um, we've got a roll of something. I don't know what that is either. What's that? Why have, we, why have we got a weird thing? I don't know what that is. Um, that can go on the floor just there. 
Right, then we've got pajamas. Hang on. Pajamas can go at the top. I know what I'm doing with these. So pajama bottom, pajama bottom, pajama top. And okay, that, that's not what I was expecting. Uh, that can go there. That's fine. Uh, oh, crikey. That's for the bathroom. Um, can it fit down there? Just put it there. Oh, it can fit just there. That's fine. There we go. That's all good. Right, back into this box. Uh, what's that? Oh, like a dumbbell weight thing. You don't need those. What do you need those for? <laughs> okay. Uh, can we get rid of that box? Right. Splendid. So that box has gone. Ah, oh, pink pig. Hello, pink pig. Lovely to see you. Uh, ooh. Oh, we've got a thing. We've got a fancy thing. Okay. Some sort of award. Right. More pants. There we go. More undergarments. On to there. There's loads of these. Crikey's. Right. And there. And there, and there. Wow, wow. <laughs> so many of them. Um, okay, ah, right, there's our little sort of art supplies thing. The game won't like that being there, but we'll just clear the stuff out for now. Even more of these, and there's a thing. Right, that goes away. Then we've got boots. Okay, so shoes can go under there. That's fine. Oh, how many pairs of shoes are we going to have? <laughs> We're going to have many shoes. Okay, one shoe there, one shoe there. And right, then we've got a shoe there and a shoe there. Don't know where these can go then. We've got some boots that are just sort of homeless at the minute. Right, okay. They're going to have to go on the floor. That's going on the floor for now. That can go on the floor for now. That can go on the floor. That can pile up. That can pile on top of there. That's a hoodie that we might want. Right, okay. So the game is going to go, what are you doing with all these things, you silly, silly person? You need to put them away properly. What is wrong with you? So, okay. Hang on, so the weights. One weight can go there, and one weight can go up there. And then that thing can move. And then I think we'll just put the hat on there, and that clears up this entire thing here, so we can put some things away, which is all very good. And then we'll grab those, grab that. Have we got, what are they? Fancy hanger things. Hang on, can we hang? Oh, they're for like, oh, are they for dresses or whatever? Okay, that's good. There we go. We've hung some things up. <laughs> Splendid. Can that go in there? Okay, the game is happy for that to go in there. Can the boots go in there? Surely we can put some shoes in there. That would be perfect, wouldn't it? Right, okay, so that's that sorted. Um, and then, yeah, that can sort of go on there with... Uh, oh, that's a, hang on, is that not pyjamas? That might be pyjamas. Um, hang on then, I've got an idea. Stack up the jeans. That's like a, a, a thing you can wear. That's also a thing you can wear. That's a thing you can wear. Bosh. Right, okay. So we've got a few things where it's going, what are you doing? But I think this should be fine. Hang on, could we put that down there? Yeah, so that's a way. So now I've got the bag, which could go uh, under the bed, at the end of the bed. Right, yeah, that can go at the end of the bed. But then what is? what do we do with this? <laughs> I don't know what this is. What did we do? A roll of something? What? Why would we have... Okay, I don't know what that's doing there. But okay, right. And we don't have a thing. We don't have a little mug for our things, which is a bit of a shame. So we'll go put the toothbrush there. Uh, sorry, toothpaste and toothbrush there. It's not happy with us putting that there. We can put it up there. Okay, right. Happy with that. Right, this is all fine. The kitchen's fine. It's not happy in here. What? Ah! Because of this weird blue rug thing. Oh, it just literally is just a rug to put on you while you're watching the television. Okay. Marvellous stuff. So, yeah, now we've moved in with somebody, which is all very good. So, we've moved in with, I mean, at least one other person. It might even be more than one person. We can't see other... Hang on. Yes, we can. Uh, yeah, there's three. So, that's our bedroom. And there are two other people. Yes, yeah, so we've moved in with two other people. So, you know, we started out as a kid in this and now we're moving in and we've graduated from uni and now we're here and you know, we're living with two other folks and we're sharing a house and it's all very lovely. So here we go. Let's click the star and see what happens next. There we go. Very nice. And there we go. We got the D20. We're officially a nerd sticker thing on there. I like that. Go geekdom. March 2007. Game nights just got more convenient. Oh, did we move in with some sort of, you know, fellow nerdy gamers that we already knew? So we didn't just sort of move into a random house, you know, sort of going, quick, I need somewhere to stay. We've kind of gone, gone yeah, these people play d, d I like them. Let's move in with them because we're buddies. Okay, what well, I think we'll do is we'll just poke our head into the next one. We'll just sort of have a little look at what the uh, the next date thing is. And we'll just see what it looks like. 
So, 2010, a very good year indeed. Oh my goodness me. Right, we've moved into somewhere very, very fancy indeed. It looks like we have a fancy apartment. There's kind of like a nice, oh, I like that. That's exciting. The sort of view changes on the angle. There's a bridge outside and we are quite high up. So we must be in some sort of fancy sort of tower block type thing. So what's going on here? So what do we have? Oh, we don't have that much stuff. We don't have that much stuff. We've got a sort of a living room. We have a kitchen, we've got a bathroom and one bedroom. Okay, let's go look at the bedroom. <gasps> okay, double bed. Double bed means we're not single. Okay, okay. I mean, yeah, maybe, maybe we are. Maybe we just bought ourselves a massive double bed. I don't know, but I'm assuming, I'm assuming that we're no longer single. Let's go have a look at the bathroom. Um, yeah, okay. Bathroom looks, it looks very clean and modern and tidy. Okay, yeah, that's quite nice. And then in here, there's whatever that is. I don't know what that is. What's that? Bamboo. Is that a bamboo thing? I don't, I don't, I'm going to put that over there and just hope that we accidentally drop it in the bin. Um, oh, look. Annoying Pan has been upgraded. <laughs> Annoying Pan is now all kinds of bronze looking. Okay, that's exciting. Um, yeah, there's not that many boxes, actually. There's not that many boxes. There's, what, four in there? Hang on, what have we got in here? What have we got in here? Yeah, look, we we have moved in with somebody else. There's a person who's going to be wearing trousers and shirts and ties. They've got some sensible shoes going on, some loafery type things. Um, they've also got immaculately kind of wrapped undergarments going on. Who, I, who does this? <laughs> Money is thrown into a drawer. Um, yeah, many, many things. Okay, so we've got that space there. And very nice. Oh, this is very good. Okay, and in here... Looking very good. And you'll see out the window again in here. We can't open the fridge, but there we go. We've got all sorts of... They've got very fancy sort of sort of cutlery going on. And yeah, chopping boards. Okay, okay, now this is fine. This is fine. It's a nice place. It's very nice. It, yeah, it's a bit snug. There's not much room around the place, but it's very well appointed. Okay, so I am aware at the back of my mind, I'm kind of aware of the request from the publishers that basically said, don't give too much away, please. Particularly from, and I didn't say this earlier, but from level four and beyond. And this is where we are now. This is level four. So what I think I'll do is I will just fly through this. I'll just get this level done. I won't sort of you know, talk about it or anything. We'll just watch it on a super speedy kind of fast sort of mode thing. We'll just fly through it. I'll try and get it done, and then we're just going to have a nosy at the next level, just because I want to see what's going on next, because I like this. And then I think we'll stop there. I think yeah, that might be sort of ruining the sort of surprises if we keep looking at every level. So, you know, we've had a look at this level. We kind of, I get the feeling with this one. We might know what's going next, but let's just get this level done. There's not that many boxes, and then we'll see what's next. And you know, I've got an idea in my head, so we'll see if I am proven correct with that. Okay, so bathroom sorted, I think. And the interesting thing this time is that we can move everything around. So when we had our shared house, we could not move anything around because I guess you know, we couldn't move other people's objects around the place because they weren't anything to do with us. Whereas now, because I assume we are sharing this apartmenty place with somebody else, with a significant other, we can just move things around as we like. We can go, yep, yeah, okay, I'm going to move that there. I'm going to put this here. And we can just move everything around. So whilst it does look very busy, we can sort of reorganise it to fit ourselves in a little bit better, which is all very good indeed. But yeah, our stuff is relatively low tech. So you know, this person who we've moved in with, they've got a fancy electric toothbrush and we've got a basic one that we've put in a cup over here. So yeah, we've got some sort of, you know, we've got some catching up to do in terms of some of our stuff, but yeah, it's fine. We can move stuff around and it makes it a significant amount easier. Okay, there we go. So all the boxes are unpacked. However, of course, we do have a few little niggling issues to deal with. So we have ourselves some sort of insecty thing there. Is that a scorpion or something? That's quite scary. Okay, so we've moved that. That's fine. That can go out of the way. Um, then we've got that. I mean, does that sit on there? Okay, right. That's fine. So that seems happy. Right, so the bathroom, not happy with that. And there's something wrong in the kitchen as well. Okay, so let's go to the bathroom. What is the problem? Um, oh, it's that spray again. Okay, just put the spray just there and everything is fine. Um, okay, and then, yeah, there's these things here. I'm not 100% sure. I think that's a laptop. 
There's a thing there with like a cat's face in it. I think that's a laptop, but I don't know what that thing is. Ah, and it's not happy with these. It's not happy with those. Okay, right, hang on a minute. Hang on. So we can we need to sort these out a little bit. There's a little bit of sort of fiddling about with things. That can go up there. Why is that? Ah, because it's not near a plug. Is that the problem? So can we move that out of the way? Hang on, can we move that out of the way? Right. Okay, we have a certain amount of space issues. Right, so yeah, so what I got from this was the person that lives here is a bit of a neat freak. They are obsessed with everything in their own place and everything has to be in the right place and all that kind of stuff. So, yeah, there's a lot of things that need to be moved around in order to accommodate our stuff. It felt like, yeah, we had to do quite a lot of work to get everything in and get everything sorted. Oh, it doesn't like that. Oh, where can we put this thing? What even is this thing? I don't know what this is. Can we bin this? Person we've moved in with, can we chuck this in the bin? I don't know what it is. Um, yeah, that can go there and that can go there. Oh, hang on. Can that tuck in just there? Okay, wonderful. And then he's just moving this. But yeah, there's a lot of, there was a lot of stuff that we had to move around, like this shelf here. We had to move a lot of that stuff around to fit all our books and such like on. And yeah, this in here, it was very sort of very heavily, heavily sort of uh, taken over by the person that I assume we've moved in with again. Um, because you know, we've moved in, our stuff is going into somebody else's space rather than sharing it from the start. Um, yeah, I don't know where this can go. I don't quite know where this can fit. I mean, yeah, there's no room on the wall for our wonderful poster thing, our wonderful whatever that is, saying, yay, we won something, we're clever. No room for that, unfortunately. That's a bit of a shame. Can that go in there? No. I don't know what we do with this. Where does this go? It clearly doesn't go in the bathroom, does it? It doesn't go in the kitchen. Does it go in here? We need to find a space for it in here somewhere. Um, hang on, it clearly doesn't go on the floor, but if we put that on, we can't put it on there. Uh, okay, right. I mean, I don't really know what it is. Some sort of art thing, but I'm not 100% sure. I mean, can we, can we put that? Hang on, can we put it on there? No, we're not allowed to put it there. Okay, I assume it goes in the bedroom, does it? Is it a bedroom thing? We've just got to find space for it somewhere in here? I really, I really don't know what this thing is. Hang on. Can we reorganize this space? Can we chuck that on there? Does that go on there? No. Okay, where does this go? I don't know where this goes. <laughs> I have no idea. Under the bed. Nope, it can't go under the bed. I don't know what it is. Also, I like the fact that Pink Pig has come with us. Pink Pig is looking a little bit worse for wear because Pink Pig is getting on in years. Look, there's a little bit of sort of a uh, little bit of damage to the back of their head. All that kind of stuff. Um, Right. I don't, I don't know where this goes. <laughs> I don't quite know what it is. Where can we put this mysterious thingamajig? And why do we need one? Oh, hang on. Hang on. Oh, it's a, it's a marker thing. Oh, it's like a whiteboard marker messaging thingamajig. Okay, I mean, that makes more sense. I, I didn't realize that was what it was. Okay, right. So here we go. So we're going to do this. We got this done. Yay, we get the guitar thingamajig. Yay for the guitar sticker. That's all very good. Now, we won't watch all the sort of the speedy up view thing again. Not all coffee's instant. Who knew? Uh, yeah, there's tea as well, I know. Uh, so, yeah, September 2010. So, we're just going to poke our nose into the next level. We're just going to have a quick look around because, you know, at the request of the publishers, we're not going to ruin things for everybody. We're just going to have a quick look around and then we show you. You can make it your own judgments from what we can see. So, here we go. How far do we go into the future? 2012. Okay, so two years after the last one. And here we go. This room looks familiar, I would say, in its sort of layout, windows and stuff outside. That looks sort of familiar. And then, yeah, the bathroom looks relatively small. Oh, hang on, what? Is that it? There's there's two rooms. Is that is that it? <laughs> okay, right. This wasn't what I was expecting. So we seem to have... Okay, hang on, hang on. I think... I, okay, right, yep. Yeah, I've made up my own mind about what's happened there. I'm not going to say anything. You can make up your own minds about it as well, because I don't want to spoil it for everybody. But uh, but yes, look, there are many, many rooms in this house, but the only two that we need to care about are the bedroom, which looks familiar, and the bathroom, where I assume we have some stuff of ours to put down, you know, sort of store away or whatever. But there we go. There we go. I don't think we'll say any more because I don't want to ruin it. However, do you know what? I am going to come back and finish this because I want to know what the story is. Because, yeah, this is really good. I do like this. I like the fact that you have to find stuff. You have to find places for all these things. Some stuff 
not entirely 100% sure what things are sometimes, but yeah, we get there in the end. But um, but yeah, I like the attention to detail. It all looks very lovely. There's just so much niceness going on. And then, um, yes, of course, you get the story as well. You get the sort of, you know, you go through, you go through life with this person. So we started in 1997 and now we're in 2012. So we've done Math with Paint 15 years. And um, yeah, it's been, it's been very exciting. I've, I've enjoyed it. But yeah, we're going to finish up for now. I'm going to finish up because we don't want to see any more to ruin it in case you decide to go and get the game and play it yourself or whatever. So yes, we'll leave it here because I think this is a good point to finish things off for now. Yeah, we've kind of, we've had a good look at the game and we've got a good chunk of the story. So we've got kind of the start of this person. So the first 15 years of the game are kind of, you know, we've had a nosy at. But yeah, let's not, uh, let's not delve in anymore. You know, you can go and get this yourself and you can go and have a go and see what's going on. And, um, and yeah, enjoy tidying things up and putting things away and all that kind of stuff. Because yes, we shall finish up for the moment. Hopefully you did enjoy this. I've thoroughly enjoyed this. It's very, very good. I do like this. I mean, it, it, it shouldn't, like in my head, it shouldn't work. So it's a game about taking things out of boxes and putting things away. So like, I don't like doing that in real life, but in a game, it works really well. It works very well. So, you know, I really enjoyed it. And the fact there's a story in it as well really sort of you know, helps it move it along a little bit and gives it that extra sort of dimension. But yeah, so I've thoroughly enjoyed this. Hopefully you have too. If you have, please do leave a like. That would be most marvellous indeed. And also, if you're not already, then please do subscribe to keep up to date with all the other bits and bobs that we get up to in the Geek Cupboard. But for now, thank you very much for joining me in the Geek Cupboard and I will see you next time. Move out of the way, friend. I'm going to completely ignore you and do some comment moderating. <laughs> Kung Fu Croquet. Maria, you've broken my heart. There you go, some more flowers that I stored at the back of my pants. Lovely, there <laughs> we go. As you can see, I'm having the wildest of times. Enormous banana massacre. <laughs>